How are you YouTubers? <sighs> Today I have a D23L deep cycle century battery. Um, now I've got a pretty good feeling about this one being a deep cycle battery. Um, let's see if I can hold this on here. No, I don't think I'm going to be able to. It's down to 8. 8.3 volts. Now I've already drained all the previous acid water mixture out of it. I'm going to use my pre-mix of 4 litres of distilled water and 375 grams of essence salts to try and revive this battery. Right, so um, I've topped up all my cells with my solution of um, Epsom salts and distilled water. And as you can see here it's about 8.4 volts, so I'm going to give it a charge with my 2.5 amp charger and um, see if I can get this cell girl back. She's a little bit swollen, but being a deep cycle, I'm really hoping I can um, save this one. Alright, so here we go, charger's hooked up and it is pulling all of the 2.5 um, amps that this charger can pull out. So, it's taking the juice in and um, we'll see how everything turns out. Alright, so it's been about 4 hours on the charger. All the cells are bubbling away nicely. Nice way to tell if you've got a dead cell or not. Um, yeah, so it's still pulling 2.6 amps at 13.2 um, volts. So um, I reckon things are looking up. All right, so this battery has been charging for approximately I don't know 28 hours or something. It's still pulling two and a half amps at 14.1 um, volts. Decided to pull it off and see if I can actually do anything with it. Um, so currently, it's pulling back down. That'll probably sit nicely at, I don't know, 12.6, 12.7. Um, I'm going to whack it in um, my old Falcon and see if it'll turn it over. Now, this is only a 65 amp hour battery. I don't know what the cold cranky amps are on it, but hopefully it'll give it a good nudge. Alright, so here it is. It's still pulling down. Um, again, this thing wasn't fully charged. I'm just going to see if it goes. Give it a couple of cranks and with a bit of luck, it'll actually do the job. Nope, oh, ignition's busted. There we go. I'll just let you know this car won't start because the injector pump. No, oh, sorry, the, the um, fuel pump is buggered. Alright, so there we go, that's a 77XC250 crossflow engine. And that's two solid cranks. And she's still holding above 12 volts. I'm... Pretty right with that. Thanks for listening. Good result.